Hello YouTube. Today I would like to share this information with you and that is about how you can activate the graphics card specifically the Sapphire R9 290 into Mac OS High Sierra. This is the version 10.13.1 release 17B48 I've been searching a while on internet on how to activate the graphics card with a full amount of video memory and finally I found a solution and this solution I would like to share with you okay so let's begin so I've been searching and scattering a lot around internet and finally I succeeded to configure the graphics card for Mac OS High Sierra. This one graphics card is the AMD Radeon R9 290 which is also compatible with the 390 but in my case I have the 290. This one has 4 GB of uh, video memory so let's see how we succeed to make this card work. So let me first show you uh, what it looks like when you have that famous problem that only 7 MB of your graphics card is recognized. So bear with me one second, I will reboot the system. Okay, let's restart the computer. So here the graphics card is not recognized. Okay, so let's see how we can fix this. All right, so without further ado, let's begin. First of all, you wanna make a backup of the config playlist. And you wanna use AV mounter to mount the AV partition. So let's double click AV mounter. Um, in my case I put the config playlist files on the USB stick, in your case it may be the hard drive, anyways so you just have to mount the AV first, I'm going to do here. So double clip AV, double click Clover, and here we have the config playlist. Right click to copy and put it into backup. I already did it. Alright, once you have backup your old initial config playlist, you want to use Clover configuration. program here, open it and then you want to go to devices and you want to go to graphics here we want to import our configuration so If we go to devices, we can see that the number 67B01002 is inserted in the fake ID. And if we go to graphics in frame buffer name, you would want to put Hawaii in video RAM we want to put the 4 gigabytes so that is 4000 
96 megabytes. We have got four video ports, so we want to put that. And here comes a very important part, which did the fix for me. So, which is the hex value of the display configuration. This is very important and tricky. So don't do not forget to insert this value. So I will put the fake ID, which is 0x and then uh, 67b01002, which is exactly the same uh, number like the one which we put in devices, this one here, which was already there, 67b01002. So 67B01002. Last but not least, you need to check inject AT, inject ATI. Okay, so once we have done that, you want to save this file by clicking this button here at the bottom and then save all right and then we want to close this just having a quick look very quickly to see if it took all the modifications which we made so if we go to devices it's still 67b01002 and on graphics Hawaii inject ATI 4096, 4 ports, and here also 67B01002, so it is 0x67B01002. Alright, so let's boot now again and see if we get all four gigabytes of video memory recognized so i will boot again I reboot the system all right so we've just rebooted let's have a look at about this mac and now as you can see we have amd radeon r9 290 slash 390 with a whopping 4 gigabytes of video memory. Wow, this looks really nice. Also the graphics now is fantastic. Okay, so don't forget to make another backup of your correct config playlist file. This is very important of course. So you mount the AV partition again. You want to go to the AV uh, partition to AV to Clover, and here you want to right-click Config Playlist, copy, and paste it into your Config Backup folder. Well, I have been uh, searching for this solution a lot on internet, scattering around, and finally uh, found this solution which I wanted to share with you guys. I hope this video was helpful for you. Please subscribe to my channel. Later I'm going to upload more videos. And don't forget to rate like comment and subscribe don't forget to share and i will see you in my next video for now stay well peace out